Hello, I am Lieutenant Prof. G. Rao, and today I will be teaching you how to install and use the TeamSpeak 3 client, as well as how to get into the Surge TeamSpeak. The first thing you need to do is download TeamSpeak 3. You can find it at this link up here, teamspeak3.com. I already have it opened up for you. Once you're there, download TeamSpeak 3 and follow all of the steps. If it asks you if you want to download Overwolf, only download it if you know what it is. I'm not going to be covering it in this video. Now, once you have TeamSpeak 3 downloaded, you will open it up. It'll look something like this. The first place you want to go to is Connections, and hit Connect. You'll type in the server address for the Surge TeamSpeak, archon.ts3.cloud. You can see it up here as well. Once you have that typed in, put in your nickname, which is your Roblox name only. Do not include your rank. Do not include anything else about you except for your Roblox name. Your rank can be assigned to you by a high rank in the TeamSpeak 3. As for server password, there is no server password, so you can just leave that blank. Once you have all this filled out, hit connect. The very minute you get here, it's a good idea to assign a bookmark to this. To do that, go up here and hit add to bookmarks. From there on, it will be very self-explanatory. Now, I have perms, which allow me to see the rest of the team speak. You won't be able to see that. Instead, all you'll see is your name with the words awaiting perms right next to you. You'll need to contact a high rank or anyone else with admin authority in the TeamSpeak 3 and they will assign you your basic ranks as an IAP. Once you have those ranks you'll be able to move to the basic off-duty and on-duty chat rooms as well as the, as well as the a AFK rooms. There are a few rules for the off-duty chat rooms. Firstly, no spam poking people. If you don't know what a poke is, I will show you. I will poke this person. So, I just poked them a message. That message will make a noise on their screen and pop up on their screen. Only they will be able to see that message. They replied back, so now you know what it's like to receive a poke. Don't spam poke. It can be very annoying, and you can get banned for it. Temporarily banned. The next rule, no inappropriate links. That one is very self-explanatory. I shouldn't need to tell you what I mean by that. Stop it, wishful. Anyway, the only other rule for the chat rooms in the off-duty section is that rule one of the codex applies. If you don't know what that rule is, you should go read the codex. Now, on-duty chat rooms. There are more rules for there. All of the off-duty chat room rules apply. However, all rules of the codex apply. Your conversation should be on topic at all times, and you shouldn't fill the voice channel with useless information about how you died. You can tell them things like, oh, there's this many people, or I died in this section, but other than that, you shouldn't be filling it with useless words. And that concludes the tutorial on how to download TeamSpeak 3. I hope this helps. If you have any further questions, feel free to contact myself or any high rank. Goodbye.